Let's see how you can use your headphones to monitor a track you want to queue up to mix next. Headphone monitoring means you can listen to the tracks on each deck independently in your headphones without affecting your master mix, which is coming out of your speakers. This enables you to make sure your tracks are going to mix together smoothly. First, make sure your headphones are connected. Remember, you can connect your speaker cable to the black output jack too. You can adjust the cue volume by accessing the settings menu at the top left of the Wii DJ interface. Select the audio option and navigate to the pre-queuing split output option. Make sure the split output option is activated. You can drag your finger along the pre-queuing volume slider to adjust the cue volume. The app is now set up to enable you to monitor a track in your headphones separately from the audio coming out of your speakers. To cue a track in your headphones, you need to use the headphone cueing section in the center of the DDJ200. Now we'll go through a quick demo of using the cue section on your DDJ200 controller. Slide the crossfader so that channel 1 is taken out of the main mix and play a track on deck 1. Now press 1 so it lights up. You should now be able to monitor the track playing on deck 1 in your headphones. Press the channel cue button again to mute that channel cue. The light will turn off to show you it's muted. Next, slide the crossfader so that channel 2 is taken out of the main mix and play a track on deck 2. Press 2 so it lights up. You should now be able to monitor the track playing on deck 2. Pressing master at the top of the headphone cue section will monitor the master audio going into your speakers. Pressing master again will mute the master output playing through your headphones. By using your headphones and the cue section, you can make sure your tracks are blended smoothly before letting your audience hear the mix.